Summon builds are the strongest build ever. They're resilient, they're snipey, they're reliable, all until around turn 10. Then you hit the plateau and you begin to realize that it actually ages kind of like a glass of unpasteurized milk. Go all in early game, build as many summons as possible, just know that every build beyond turn 12 or 13 will body you into the ground. We managed to make it work this time, but heed my warning if you plan to try this one yourself. Mosquito me, bluebird me, and groundhog. This is the, the squad. Yeah, okay. Before you say anything, <laughs> I meant that in a very loving sort of gushing, okay. Get your mind out of the gutter. Despicable. Alright, let's go here. Alright, the bluebirds have a lot of faith in this mosquito. So we're gonna have to really pull it together. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> Okay, let's do... Honestly, I'm not a huge fan of the Groundhog right here. Let's get his upgraded cousin. Roll me. Freeze me. Level me. Is, are summon builds any good here? We could do summons with Grizzly. It's kind of hard to lead up into it, though, is the issue, you know? Question, does slime work with whale? Does that slime that it spits out also summon those slimes? It's an interesting... Well, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> it's an interesting question. I'd reckon it probably wouldn't, if I had to guess, but hey. You never know. All right, we'll take the draw. I don't know how we're still at five hearts. I feel like we're kind of getting cooked out here, but hey, I'll take it. Big level up here. Fantastic news. Like this. So it's important to get this slime out early. Start getting him scaling up a bit. Beautiful. And we win by one. Look at that. Alright, give me a solid tier four, please. We can test our whale theory. Probably important to test it now. So that we know. I will say though, the skunk is looking pretty good. I think we're gonna want a skunk here too. So it's not going to summon anything right now, just in case you were expecting it to. Um, yeah, I mean, this guy's huge. Level 3 Bunyip is no joke early game. Late game, it's a bit of a joke, but... <laughs> Level me. Microbe Chimera. Eh. Doesn't seem great. Roll me. Uh, let's keep the kangaroo cooking. Let's give you a fig, because I don't think you would need any other held foods. Okay, so now, this is going to summon one slime, and then when he dies, it should summon another. Well, I guess we're not going to know. <laughs> we'll find out next time. Alright, roll me. Slime me. Wording. Okay, that's good, and then still it's probably not sticking around forever. Yeah, I don't think we need any of these. I will take a whale. Contingent upon this actually working. But I think we'll probably keep the whale regardless. Really? <laughs> How are figs that strong? That seems crazy to me. They can just take out your whole friggin' team. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Do a little buy sell action here. Not the frost wolf. That sounds terrible. Cool. 
So this is looking solid. You're going to be summoning hopefully two. Okay. Now let's see. Ooh. All right, we're going to have to reevaluate. The slime whale is not the play. Okay, so in that case, we need to get rid of the mosquito and find a better faint pet ASAP. Grizzly is an integral part, I think. I'm not seeing any good faint pets here. <laughs> Snapping turtle, actually, though. Do we ever get rid of kangaroo? Not yet, but probably, probably soon. Alright, we're just gonna use you as a little 612 body here. Okay, good stuff. And that'll clean them out. Thank you very much. Level me. Yeah, not really doing the Leviathan thing, I don't think. Let's run it like this. Um, give you some love in here. So now the fig's gonna go off and then it'll override, I think, is how that'll work, hopefully. If not, we have issues. <laughs> hopefully that is how that works. Let's find out. Well, we will never know. Alright, the skewer held us in. Okay, so, uh, how do we want to run this? These three are integral. This is, this can be switched. I'd rather not get rid of the Grizzly, to be honest. I think the Grizzly is kind of crucial here. Huge. I'm so glad we found that so early. Thank you. And yeah, freeze a chocolate. Don't mind if I do. Now let's see if we can find anything that isn't a snipe team. That kind of counts. Okay. And then we got slimes. Cool. Love it. Not interested in any of these. Let's do... I'm thinking it's a grizzly angle. Upgrading the slime doesn't increase the number of slime spawns, so I'm not hugely inclined to do that. So I think we're just trying to get the Grizzly to level 3. And we actually don't need to level you, because you're going to summon another one, which is then going to throw it on there. So I think this is how we're playing it. <laughs> this might just be our end game. Well, that's unfortunate. But I think the Grizzly's gonna pull it together. Dude, this th this is giving me throwbacks to when the Grizzly first came out. And they had wicked balance issues. Like, it was bad. <laughs> Fortunately, that's not an issue anymore. Said no one ever. Alright, I think... The Fly is probably better than the Skunk because of the Grizzly. Let's think about this. One, two, three. Do we think that three fifths of 18 times two <laughs> is better than 66% off of one? Dude, this is too much math. I'm just gonna throw in the fly. Call it a day. And I think we can put the fly here because you're gonna get one here and then you're gonna get one here and then another one from summoning the snapping turtle again. I'll give you a chili. Don't say I won't. Thank you for not running snipes. I appreciate it. I mean, I think we're okay. Get as much attack as you would like. I think we're totally fine. Yeah. Not a problem at all. Snipes, definitely a problem. Anything else, really? Don't care. Thank you. 
I mean, this is about as good as you could hope for for a summon build. You got the snipes. Snipes are actually just kind of running rampant this weekly. I can tell already this is going to be a nightmare trying to work around snipe teams. Roll me. I guess we're just trying to get the fly to level 3, right? What else are we really going to upgrade? I think we can work with this guy. This is the real test. Can you take out a Leviathan team? <laughs> That's the question. We can draw a Leviathan team. Does that count? Roll me. Oh, roll me. Give me a fly, thank you. Yeah, I mean, I don't... This is kind of the upper... I guess we can get mushrooms. This is like the upper edge of what can be done here. Dude, so many friggin' snipe teams out here. What the heck? Okay, so I've decided we need... Well, okay, so we can put potato or whatever on the grizzly. It's not gonna do nothing. <laughs> That's not gonna help because everything else is still getting sniped. It's just a lost cause. You just have to hope you don't go against snipe teams. Like this. Okay. Nope. <laughs> I think we have reached our cap. I don't think we're getting to 10 wins here. <laughs> this is looking less than promising. Um, give you a mushroom, I suppose. I mean, what are we even going to chocolate? <laughs> right? Like, oh, we got nothing. Sure. We can upgrade our whale if we live to next turn. The only other thing I could possibly think of is putting salt for like these fishes, but the, I don't have one unit that really works with that, you know? So I'm kind of thinking that's a, a lost cause. Oh, dude, the mushroom. That is not at all how I pictured the mushroom working there. <laughs> Oh, uh, see, that's the problem with the Leviathan. Disregarding the obvious salt counter to the Leviathan, you cap out almost harder than this snipe or the summons team did. And that's saying something. Well, we got summons working. That's fantastic news. Some skulking slackers. A little golden. Saving us at the end. Thank you very much. I'm loving the double double bluebird here. Can you make it a triple bluebird? I am now realizing that the basilisk made its way to the front and turned his guy into a into a rock. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, it doesn't have to be an allied pet, does it? Go here, go here. Maybe we get a summon build going? Just maybe? Okay, this is gonna be our setup. Bluebird's getting our groundhog going. I think we're good. We're looking for kangaroos. We're looking for... Yes, bluebirds. <laughs> Can't say I'm loving that one, but throw a swan in the mix. Okay. Almost at a level three bluebird. Kind of cracked. I can genuinely say that Frostwolf did nothing. All right. Swan can go, throw a woodpecker in the mix. 
Try to get him some pineapple or something. Or all me. We're getting a lot of almost levels. Just gotta help convert them a bit here. Huge. Not interested. Interested. Very interested. <laughs> uh, we could go blowfish, potentially. I don't think I'm ready to fully commit yet. But it, it's an option. Oh gosh, that is ugly. But we did make it with one help. Yeah, this is... Alright, I'm saying no to the blowfish. Let's get some levels going. I think it's gotta be this guy gone, right? Okay, bluebird sticking around. <laughs> I think skunk is the way forward. And I definitely want you. Bluebird agrees. Skunk is the way. And... Alright, we're good. Go here. And roll me. Not interested. I'll grab a potato for the kangaroo, I guess. Though realistically, I think the kangaroo is probably going soon. Valid. Yeah, I think the, the kangaroo is going to swap for a bear. Uh, I don't think the whale has a place here. Huge. Less huge. <laughs> Bro, man. Give me a bear. You got a bear for me. Maybe this bluebird will give me a bear. I think we're good. That is four slimes coming right up. Man, where are all the bears hiding? <laughs> this is a pain. Roll me. I don't need you. Roll me. All right. I mean, it's, it's definitely a bear, right? I'm not just, like, tunneling here. The bear just seems so natural with this slime. Ooh, he managed to draw. Impressive. Not looking for the slime. Not really even looking for you. I'll consider you. Your consideration period is over. <laughs> no longer needed. Thank you for your service. The big hurt team. And the, the phoenix gets there. What the heck? Alright, here. Hold on to that. I think we can do this. I value the level 3 woodpecker significantly. Dude, what the hell is going on here? <laughs> This is the, the whole weekly in a nutshell. It's just this garbage snipe fest. What the heck? You give a bear a potato and he's still not safe. Um, roll me. Skunk. I'm just looking for bears, honestly. <laughs> bears and beets. Ok, 
Okay. If we had a larger bear, <laughs> we may have had a chance. But that's not gonna happen. Leviathan's kinda cracked this weekly, I'm starting to realize. Thank you. Got the bear cooking. Alright. Let's just keep going. I'm realizing that the summon build <laughs> tends to fall off pretty hard. Um, yeah. Dude, what even is this? <laughs> it's ridiculous. So many snipes. Alright. And we're just looking for bears. Bear me. Um, keep going. Keep going. What do you got for us? Everyone gets one attack. Everyone gets some ice cream. Fantastic news. What do we got? Snipes? Adjacent to snipes. But we're good. Alright. <laughs> I think we can thoroughly determine at this point summon builds. I don't even know if this counts as a summon build to be fair, but summon builds is looking at these two. You know, you, you're really good and then it's just hard plateau and you got to get kind of lucky to get through to that 10th one. That's my experience at least. Let me know if you found a better way to do it because clearly this isn't the best. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good one.